Creating a LinkMe account is extremely quick and easy. If you visit the membership pricing page, you'll want to select the account type that best suits your needs. For this example, we'll sign up for the personal account, which is only $5 per year and allows you to manage up to three LinkMe API keys. These can be used on any WordPress website that you have. Each account type offered by LinkMe is free for the first month, so if you cancel it before your month trial is over, you will not be charged. So I'll just click sign up here, and I'll enter my name, and my email address, and the username I want to use. And you want to use a password that's fairly secure. And now you want to select the billing method. And I'll just select PayPal because it's pretty simple to use. Once you're brought to the PayPal portal, you'll put in your PayPal username and password, and then it'll ask you to agree and continue to the uh, Link Me setup page. So I click agree and continue, and it will bring me back to Link Me. And now all you have to do is click this login link, and you want to use the username and password that you set up. And it will automatically log you into your account settings page, where you can add your Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, and FriendFeed account. If you click add new Twitter, it will ask you to authorize the application. And we'll do the same for Facebook. And it will ask you to approve the application again. There's an issue with Facebook where if you try to add Facebook to multiple LinkMe accounts, uh, the first account you set up won't work anymore because Facebook invalidates the old access token. So you only want to add one Facebook account to a single LinkMe account. And that's why we now offer multiple API keys with a single LinkMe account. So let's add LinkedIn. and front feed. Facebook also will invalidate your token after 60 days. So every 60 days you'll have to come in here and re-authenticate Facebook. It's pretty simple uh, and it's something new that they just started. So now you want to go to manage your API keys and you'll start with none. Just click add new and click the API key to edit it. This is where you're going to select which accounts you want to post to. And if you have any pages or groups, it'll allow you to select those. But I'm just using this for my personal account. And I'm just going to put in my personal domain as an alias to this API key. And it'll change it here. And that way, when I add my other API keys, it doesn't get very confusing because these long strings of numbers just don't really make any sense. So it's easier to add an alias so you know where they're actually going to go to. But I'm just going to delete these because I'm not going to use them for now. So now all you need to do is highlight your API key and copy it and head on over to your WordPress website. I already have LinkMe 1.4.0 installed on my WordPress website and activated. So now I just need to add my API key. And I'll click Verify Link Me API Key to make sure it went OK. And then I'll Save Settings. And for this, I want to enable all the social networks and click Save. Now the next thing I want to do is just check the settings. And I can send a t test tweet. And uh, my personal profile is checked. So I'll send a test message. And again with LinkedIn and then friend feed. And that's all you need to do. You can customize each of these. Uh, you can customize the tweet format and you can customize the Facebook message and a little bit of the LinkedIn message and a little bit of the um, friend feed message. But it's that easy. Uh, after this everything is uh, working for you. Uh, if you add a new post from now on, it will automatically publish to your social networks. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me at support at link.me. Thank you, and have a good day.